All right, so I thought I would show you all how to do the um, the ink replacement in a non-normal or, or an updated BIC four-color pen. Um, it's a little different from the one that I showed, the basic four-color pen that you can just lever apart by pressing like that, hold the top in one hand. But if you do that with one of these new ones and it's got the curve around it, this is one of the kind with the... Um, mechanical pencil and three colors so really nice pen but uh, harder to change the ink in so you take it apart um, you just uh, in that case you just unscrew your pen you're gonna need a pliers or a side cutters for this one you can't just do it with your hands uh, because you need to get um, on that collar like that and any pliers will work try not to um, Press down firmly, but don't crush it because you can ruin the threads on the plastic. Uh, so again, just like before, hold on to the head with one hand and just push with your thumb. And it'll pop out. Um, and then you just work it free. Um, the collar will come off just like with the normal pen. Um, and, uh, and then you can just, you can either take these off, um, you know, by pulling them off like that. Um, that's actually the simplest with this one. Um, something to note if you are doing one with the mechanical pencil um, is uh, oops, is the um, there we go. So one will probably volunteer to drop first. <laughs> Move the others up out of the way. Um, and just poke it through. Once it drops, the rest should come out pretty easily. Um, so there you go. One thing to note, when you're putting this back together, make sure you either mark or just remember which spring goes with the lead holder, uh, the mechanical pencil part. And also, if you look very closely here, um, let me refocus here. If you look very closely, one of the four um, sides of the collar is slightly larger to also to fit the mechanical pencil so they made it work but they had to make a custom spring you can see that the size is a little larger on it. it's this one here and they had to make a, a bigger um a bigger uh spot in the collar so um so make sure when you reassemble it that you're lining everything up now in terms of reassembly um it's really hard to get them all in there uh, you have this additional thing with the mechanical pencil that holds the eraser. Um, so you're going to want to line that up on the diagonal. If, if you're not careful, it'll end up like that, blocking the way. So make sure you line it up on the diagonal. Oops. See, I made it look easy the first time, didn't I? Um, there we go. So you line it up on the diagonal, get it in there so it works. And then... Um, I think you'll probably find it easiest to do the uh, um, mechanical pencil first because it's the odd one out. And also because this has a curve to it, it's only going to go in two ways out of the four possible ways. My cat is attacking my plant. Lovely. Move, move. Um, it's only going to go two of the four ways, right? If it's at 90 degrees, you'll get it almost all the way back together and then it won't line up. So. A nice way to, to um, solve that problem before it starts, and do not eat my plant. Um, to solve that problem before it starts is just to put the, um, either to remember where they came from or just to put the um, pencil in to the right of the um, clip. And that'll, that'll, that'll align it correctly so that it doesn't end up um, not able to close all the way when you get it back together. So you just slide it back in. Um, don't worry about the collar. The collar you do last. So slide it back in there. Um, the rest, uh, if you did pull it apart the way I did there, um, make sure you're getting the right color. Unless you're playing a prank on a friend. Uh, make sure you're getting the right color in with... Uh, um, In with the with that you reattach it that you reattach the um, oh that's great there we go that's the blue looks like I might need to replace one of my inks after all so I put it back together 
um, like so, and then I just slide that in. I'm going to kind of wiggle it around to find the slot for it. Okay, with the last one, you probably will find that it's actually easier to slide it in from the top. You could do that with all of them, I suppose, except the um, pencil won't fit, again, because of the slightly larger size. So make sure that's out of the way. Drive that in, drive it down so it seats. And then you got all four back in. Make sure you didn't lose any springs on the way. And then as you're putting the collar on, just rotate the collar around until you see that flat side on the collar with the two little uh, grooves next to it. That's the one that goes on the uh, mechanical pencil. So there's that. Collar goes on. Remember the threads go down because you're going to screw it back on. That goes back in. Just give it a nice firm pressure. And it'll seat. Screw the um, bottom back on and then just test and make sure all four work. And you're done.